Hey Capricorn, welcome to my channel. This is a special reading session for you. This reading for today, Capricorn, is Will They Reach Out Tarot Reading Session for you. I hope you're okay. I hope you're fine. Before I start, Capricorn, I want to thank you for your amazing support, your likes, and your subscribe. If you guys are interested to further support my channel, check the description box below because you'd see the details of my Instagram account, my Etsy store, my other two channels. And um, yeah, that's it. If you haven't subscribed, if you are a guest viewers, guys, my team here in YouTube, they are amazing. There's no basher. And it's really a positive um, community in Sunshine TV. So click subscribe now, click the bell. And for my previous subscribers, thank you guys for the amazing views, likes, and your subscribe. And thank you for the generous donation. It keeps the channel going. All right. So let's start your reading, Capricorn. Will Capricorn significant person reach out, please? Advice. Intuitive message, please. Here you go, Capricorn. First card is you've got the Six of Cups in Reverse. Sorry, Eight of Cups in Reverse. The Emperor card. The Ace of Cups. The Seven of Wands. You've got the Fool card. I'm going to be delivering two messages for today. The Wheel of Car the wheel of Fortune and the Ace of Pentacles. Okay. Let's start someone from the past. This could be an ex, all right? Or it could be um, a situation where you are on and off ghosting with this person okay this is someone in the past um okay the past energy between you and this person is that they walk away it was a premature walking away like you haven't really you haven't really fully explored the feelings between the two of you and they walk away emperor card this is was there was some sort of impulsive decision making between the two of you okay so at the current energy ace of cups you know this person they're kind of upset or angry or disappointed because they do have feelings for you but it could be you it could be them but someone walk away someone gave up the ace of cups this person they would call you or text you or touch base with you and they are a bit aggressive or argumentative there's a possibility that you would call this person because I feel like part of this missed opportunity or walking away, for some of you, it's your fault. So I see and I feel intuitively with the seven of wands, there's a 60% this person will reach out. And the way this person reach out is they will tell you off to kind of, let's put boundary. They're kind of upset, disappointed, or pissed off with how things were, were dealt in the past because you know someone withdraw someone was immature someone walk away so this is the subject matter they're bringing towards you okay 60 percent of you guys you would um, receive some sort of response reply or follow-up but it's a bit argumentative if you manage to speak with this person diplomatically and explain your side diplomatically and compromise um, they won't draw the line but if this person reach out or you reach out and you still argue this person would put a limit or would put a boundary between the two of you because if you look at them they're already upset okay someone upset someone someone withdraw the ace of cups someone walk away impulsively um, without having a lot of thought like it was immature so this is the subject matter this is the next cycle of you and them that if you communicate it's going to be an argument if you manage to be diplomatic and ground this person to like pacify this person to hey don't judge me don't overreact let's be diplomatic then things would be to be continued between the two of you but if at some point capricorn this person triggers you to be angry to be upset this person would draw the line there's a possibility of i'm gonna limit you in my life I still see and feel that you would communicate in the future but in the April and May I see you communicating again but argumentative like a clash all right now the next reading this is someone recent or current energy because this is someone in the past this is someone recent okay recent connection so the full card also if you guys are not in speaking terms this person is not um, over with you 
but they're not taking a risk or they're not really there's a whole back period if you look at the wheel of fortune and the world guard this is this is pretty much um this is opposite this is exactly opposite energy this is like negative positive so i feel like your person they don't want to take a risk they want to take things slow they've been burnt in the past okay if you look at the wheel of fortune this is them this is your person they're in red it means that at some point in the past they've experienced heartbreak pain um, third party disappointed so they're making sure that their movement it is easy slow and progressive so i see this person offering you an ace of pentacles okay i see this person seriously starting off something towards to you that is tangible that is stability in terms of love romantic i would really prefer the ace of pentacles so this person would date you would spend time to you to get to know you okay but in terms of opening up their feelings towards you they're kind of defensive okay i see this person communicating to you or reaching out to you in not in a romantic way it could be it could start with friends or let's hang out let's you know let's have a regular conversation they might not open up right away because of their past experience it's more of it's telling me that they're not a fool this person is mature they're gonna take it slow you might be you might find it um, boring but this is just how they want things to start off or kick off ace of pentacles this is good this is to be trusted so i see them a slow progress reaching out to you like don't take it personally this is just how they communicate or their style you know i'm open to anything but let's take it slow like if this person if you're not successful romantically you can keep this person as friends you can really value this person both lovers and friends i'm really getting a good vibe with this person could be capricorn taurus or virgo i'm i'm feeling in here a cancerian a piscean and a scorpio energy in here i see aries leo sagittarius as well okay um yep so this is you this is your reading thank you so much capricorn for tuning in for stopping by um i'll see you soon uh, you take care and um be safe and um um i'll see you soon again have a great day bye bye